This is a closet where you keep most of your clothes and other items in. But the thing is, it's not very fun just to keep clothes and other stuff in. So I then decided that I'm going to be transforming this closet into an ultimate gaming fort. First of all, let me go ahead and give you guys a small tour of this closet. As I walk in here, you guys can already see that I cleared the whole entire closet out. We got a small window up here, which I'll actually be covering later because we're going to have LED lights all around the closet. We have tons of room in here, and I got to say, this is going to be the coolest gaming fort I've ever been. Some of the things we're gonna have is an Xbox, a monitor, a mini fridge, a cool strobe light, tons of other cool things which I'll be showing later in the video. So without further ado, let's go ahead and buy some items. Not the camera. It is now the next day and today's the day that we're actually going to be starting to build the fort. As you can see, we got some of our items here such as the mini fridge, Xbox monitor, and then a bunch of other cool things I'll be showing later in the video. And as you guys can see, it is pouring outside, so I guess I picked the right day to do this. Let's first begin by putting the LED light strip on. So I kind of just put the lights up like this for now. I think they look pretty cool. And I'm going to be using this drawer as my table for everything I'm going to be using. So let's just slide it right in there. Perfect. Can't forget the monitor. Literally the most important part to the gaming setup. Just after putting a few things in, this is what it looks like so far. Xbox. Mouse pad transition. Wow, that looks so cool. Let's see. Next up, why not put this? Little loot box. Then YouTube TV show, which obviously stands for the Turner Bovey show. Mountain Dew fridge. By the way, this video is not sponsored. Which obviously goes right there. Like, that's the best spot. That I just took out of the way. Now, you guys might be getting a little bored now. So, just enjoy this nice montage of me decorating. Forgot I gotta change the batteries out. I hope you guys enjoyed that little montage and now this thing is looking insane. Like look at it so far. We got all this stuff, all the decorations, decorations here, but there are still a few more things. Such as this gaming neon light, which I got about a year ago for my birthday. I'm thinking I'm gonna put it over there. So let's go grab some tape and put it up. Okay, so do you guys want the good news or the bad news first? Well, the bad news is I never found the double-sided tape. But the good news is that I found some kind of tape. I hope this will work. Jeez, that's strong tape. Now I'm just gonna fold it like this, I guess. Just make it double-sided tape. Stick it right on the back and let's go see if it works. All right, so the good news is it works. So let's plug it in now. Finally, like 30 minutes later, I got this thing up and working. Here's another secret item I got. It's a neon purple alien light and it's gonna look so cool. It's gonna go right here probably. Alien light is now installed. Everything looks perfect. Final thing to do is to add my gaming chair. So we kind of got a problem here. As you can see, the chair is a little too big. Somehow I squeezed the chair in here. Don't ask me how I did it. It's a little complicated. Full closet gaming for is now complete. Let me go ahead and give you guys a tour. So soon my friend Brom is coming over and he has no idea that I built this. So let's wait for him to come and get his reaction. Brom has arrived. Let's go and show him what I built. All right, Brom. So what do you think I built? Uh, I honestly have no idea because you didn't text me or tell me anything about this. Okay. Yeah. Good point. Brom, is there anything suspicious to you around here? Not really. Oh, wait, hang on. That wasn't there before. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Brom, open the door. Oh, so this is what it is. Okay. This is your new setup, isn't it? Yeah, it's this my is, new setup. This is cool. What's what's all that down there? Uh, don't worry about that. That's just some <laughs> wires. Yeah, don't worry about okay. that. I like this. What are, you, what are you gonna put up there? Uh, nothing. I like the lights here. Yeah, the lights are cool. That's the things that are falling down, actually. Okay, this is, this is very good. I like this. To give Rom the full cool experience, I'm gonna turn the lights off to make it look even cooler. All right, Rom, what would you rate this out of 10? I don't have, I don't have a rating yet. I gotta see how comfortable it is to sit. What is this? <laughs> what is that, Turner? I forgot to tell him that you can't turn in that chair. Turner, eight out of 10. 
Wow, I see how it is. What about, what if you're like, what if you need to like concentrate and sit? We can't do this. <laughs> what? What the crap is this, Turner? Uh, just a gaming kind Seven of Seven out of ten. No. Oh. So far it's been very okay, I guess. But what is, what does this mean? Is oh. That no internet? Yeah, I forgot to tell him about the no internet. Six out of ten, Turner. What? But look at this place. It's so cool, and you give it a six out of ten. Okay, I'll show you why. That's your leg room. That. What? You, that's amazing leg room. I don't know what you're talking about. I'll demonstrate. <laughs> you see this? This is the issue. How do you game like this? <laughs> I mean, realistically though, seven and a half out of ten. All right. That that that's a fair one. Seven out of ten is the official answer for this fort. Now since everything is complete, Vrom is here, everything is here, let's begin gaming. First game we're gonna be playing is The Crew 2, which is a car racing game. It's gonna be cool, Vrom is gonna play it. Right now, Vrom is driving near Arizona, somewhere in the west, and what car are you driving? Shelby GT500. Shelby GT500. Let's see how fast this thing can go. The 200 mark. Hit 200. Oh, 223 was the top speed. Oh no. Oh, we're still going. Okay. 236. 236 is the fastest speed on this car. This next and final car that Brahm is going to be driving is, uh, what is it? A C2 Corvette. A C2 Corvette. Let's see what the top speed is on this thing. Speeding up, almost at 200. <laughs> oh, he crashed. I'm very good at driving. Wow, he's so good at driving. All in. Let's see what we get. 216. 216 is the fastest speed on this car. Shelby's faster than the Corvette, so Shelby wins. Next game I'm gonna be playing is Fortnite. I'm only gonna play one match, so let's make it good. Okay, the match is about to start in six seconds, so let's see how it goes. I'm gonna land your old fashioned tilted towers. All right, I got my first chest with the little shotgun. Auto shotgun. Oh gosh, what is that thing? I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> no! Oh my gosh, you guys been wanting gaming content, so here you go. I'm gonna play one Fortnite match and probably die right away. Well, I cannot see where that guy is. What is that? Oh gosh, it's a tornado and that thing is about to explode. Oh, watch this. Oh yes, I'm... Oh no. I'm gonna hit him, I'm gonna get him. There's a person. I'm gonna actually get a clip. Oh. No, no, no! No! Wow. I died. To wow. C Works 63. C Works 63. Go report him, guys. This is another crazy and really fun video to film. Like, you gotta see, this was really fun, right? Yes, it was really cool. Yeah, it was really fun. And if you guys want me to change your closets into an ultimate gaming fort like this, just call me over. I'll change your closet into the gaming fort. Well, I got a lot of cleanup to do now, and I'll catch you guys next time. <laughs>